okay, keep, I, I, I don't know, bodies change, guys, right, I, I, you know, this, but there's something significant with eyes, so your eyes could be changing, I'm not saying the color, it could be, it could be within the dynamic, um, I don't know how eyes really work, but if you take a photo of your eyes, look at it again in a couple days, like, I'm not, there's something extremely relevant with eyes, um, it could have to do with DNA, considering I was talking about Mia, but it, your own personal DNA, right, um, could be shifting. I don't know if the little triangle on my ear is going to stay there or not. Again, your bodies change every seven years, right? So I, if this is my seventh year, then I just hope for the best. <laughs> um, and my face has already changed. Like, there's certain stuff. Like, we just talked about this a few weeks ago when something, like, significant in my life, like a, a massive, like a, a huge change, upgrade, whatever, whatever it is, however you want to say it, place it, whatever terminology you want to use, however you want to interpret it, um, so for me, that, that seven-year mark is, is probably here, um, if that's what it's in accordance to. But there is something, like I said, extremely, oh, yes, relevant. Oh, I had you plugged in. Sorry, let me flip you. It's the tree. It's the tree with the eye. So you can't make this shit up, guys, right? So, um... I was going to bubble you, but I don't, I don't have time to bubble you because I got tons of work. And, okay, so I just spoke about the eyes. In reference to, I just said reptile, yeah. In reference to reptilian, uh, anywho, in reference to the reading. If this is you and somebody, just do your best to stay open. Let, let it come back around. If it comes back around, again, there's a lesson there, right? Um, it's either on both of you or a one of you. If this is just solo and it's you, this is like in accordance to like the cards and the spirit guides, the spirit animals, it's, it's on you to be assertive, be receptive, you know, to your gifts, to the energy to family to work whatever it may be right um it could a lot of this has to do with your your creativity so be careful for all my women and i'm going to speak on women right now I, I love my men too right but be careful with this this um queen of swords energy because with the ace of wands and the knight of wands um that's a lot of passion. It's a lot of creativity. It's a spark. It's imagination. It's creativity. It's, you know, so it's opportunities. You kind of bounced into the queen of swords, which is good logically, practically, mentally. Um, it's great to find that balance, but it did say coming together. So even if this is solo and it doesn't have to do with somebody else, find the balance because you want to, you want to, you want to get back to either the, the Queen of Wands or the Empress, okay, um, to get back into that energy. So if the energy was there and it was taken, no such thing as really taken, right? Reopen, reopen that channel to benefit you so you can move forward. So we had the Kruger, the Mystic, the Dragon, with the Knight of Wands, Ten of Swords, we had that self-care, all that, you know. Um, Shape-shifting in the sense of where you're at. It's a chameleon, right? Um, be the chameleon. Be the pig and shit and be the chameleon. Okay? I love you guys. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. And... See, it must have to do with somebody else, too. If it does have to do with somebody else, um, be open. Even if it went from an ace to a ten and you don't know where it stands, just in your mind be open why you bring that, why you channel the energy of that ace of wands again, okay? Don't get caught up in that ten of swords unless two people are being open. And it's, it looks like one's open, one's not. They can say they're open, but there's distance. So until that conversation is had, you know, focus on 
your candle, light your candle, light your wick, right? Um, and mentally just try to stay open while you light your wick again, okay? Because you feel the projected energy. And that's where I need to stress it here that that your wick holds precedence right now. If you guys are gonna light that wick together, great. But right now it's, it's your wick, okay? Um, you have the lighter, you have the candle, your creativity, your mentality, stuff like that, okay? I love you guys so much.